Hello everyone, I'm Ernie and I am so glad you're here with us today. Today we are going to make our stannous chloride so we can check our solution to see if there's any gold, platinum, or palladium in our solution. And I understand that there are multiple ways of making stannous chloride, but we're going to do it in this process today and let's get into it. Here are the ingredients and materials that we will use to make our stannous chloride. We have our stannous chloride crystals and we have four pure tin shots, distilled water, hydrochloric acid at 31.4% and we have a dropper bottle to store our stannous chloride in and we have some aqua regia with gold to test our stannous chloride and we have our filter paper and a scale to weigh out our materials. We will first weigh out one gram of stannous chloride crystals and add it into the beaker. Next, we will add in one gram of pure tin. This tin shot is made by Dr. Fish and they are tin weights for fishing. I purchased this on Amazon for $10 and there are 100 tin shots in a pack, but it only takes four tin shots for this process and these four tin shots weigh one and a quarter gram. Now we will add in 25 milliliters of distilled water. Now we will add in 30 or so drops of hydrochloric acid at 31.4%. As we let our solution settle for a few minutes, we will take this opportunity to cut up some test strips of filter paper to test our aqua regia and stannous chloride.
we will now take our stannous chloride and pour it into this dropper bottle using a funnel. And I realized as I started doing this is that the 10 shots will not fit inside the funnel. So I will have to do it once I get the solution into the bottle. We will now take our aqua regia and put a drop or two on our test strip. And I know there's gold in here is because I've been saving a little bit of aqua regia from the different projects I had been doing. And so we know that there's gold in the aqua regia. Now we will test and see if the stannous chloride is working. And yes, the Stannis Chloride is working. What I want to do now is take some of this Aqua Regia and use the store-bought Stannis Chloride and see how that compares to the Stannis Chloride we had just made. And you can see the store-bought stannous chloride and our stannous chloride that we just made are working basically the same. Our stannous chloride will stay effective for three months. Well, this wraps up this episode of making our stannous chloride. And I hope you enjoyed the episode. And if you did, smash that like button. Share this on your channel so others can enjoy the procedure. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel, I would like to encourage you to subscribe and to become part of our AU family. We're so thankful that you're here. We deeply appreciate your support. And we will see you on the next one.